is up? This is Joking Johns D4 here, bringing you guys more Benefit 15 Ultimate Team, and welcome to game number three of season 5.2. Today, we're going to be able to see more of the original roster of season four and season five going at it, and also exploring my new plays, guys. Remember, I've been saying it since game number one. I've been adding new offensive plays on my playbook lately. So, be in here for a surprise, guys. Now, another thing that really happened in this game, guys, I would like to say is it was a good game. You know, I rated a 5 star, man. A 5 star out of 5, it, it is a must watch game. I mean, it came down to that close, man. So, I'm not going to spoil it anymore. All I'm going to say is, good job, Derek Carr. You really stepped it up in this game. It was all Derek Carr, I believe. I mean, he was, he was very accurate in this game. And also, my defense, good job. So, on the first play, actually, on the second play of the game, um, the guy ended up throwing down the middle of this, that was actually one of my new defensive formations which I was trying to test out, but apparently he found a flaw, so I'm like, yeah, I'm no longer going to do that defense anymore. So, uh, yeah, that defense, that new defense I was trying out was, no, it was a big no. So I ended up back in the offense, 7-0, 1 minute and 50 seconds to go in the first quarter. Cordell Patterson open, going on the slant route right there, he's playing man coverage, a nice counter right there with Doug Martin, taking it almost all the way, only if Darrell Young would have covered that guy, I would have actually taken it at least, at least like 10 more yards further. Uh, run down the middle with Marshall Lynch, we haven't seen that guy like for the longest time, ever since Bo Jackson took over, we haven't seen Marshall Lynch at all, he was buried in my depth chart. Uh, another play action play right here. Nice catch by Damaris Thomas. I believe that one should have been intercepted, guys. Yes, I do admit that was one lucky hell of a catch, man. It was a lucky catch. Um, you know, I do admit sometimes, you know, sometimes my under underdog catches can be very, you know, like what the fuck moments. I admit that, you know, it was it's sometimes it's sometimes like very insane. So moving on, guys. I ended up making this guy turn over seven to seven. Uh, he ended up not converting the ball at all in the fourth and one or fourth and two. And uh, which is nice, you know, good job my defense is stepping up compared to the last time I was playing on Season 5. And he ended up blitzing everybody and he intercepts the ball. I mean, come on, man. I believe the running back was open in this play. You guys can go back like a few seconds before uh, the play was uh, called in. The running back was open. He was not covered. Yes, it was a big, huge mistake of me. I should have used the running back a lot more often in this gameplay. So, uh, moving on on defense, yes, he ended up going into that little... Um, triangle route that the running back does uh, half of the time I know when people call it in I'm like yeah that's the cheapest way to to score which is good you know that's one of the easiest ways to score on the near the when you're near the goal line and then Jason Morrow coming with a comeback right here with a nice streak route and a nice catch Cardo Patterson in a slant route catching it between two defenders another 10 yard gain running it down the middle Doug Martin our legendary running back touchdown seven yards Nice one. 14 to 14, third quarter, one minute and 30 seconds to go. Sack and another sack to David Clowney. Cameron Wish should have had the first one, but goddamn, to David Clowney over there being a Superman, save his sack. Nice uh, protection right there by Leo Keekley. I don't know what he was trying to do right there. I mean, there was, nobody was open since like the beginning of the play. Cadell Patterson wide open right here since he's playing man coverage. No one from his defense is going to be able to catch up to uh, Cadell Patterson. He's freakishly fast. And then right here, yes, I messed up. I kind of felt the pressure and, um, you know, I kind of got to test out my, um, you know, my patience a little bit more with the all man and CPU, man. I mean, I did test out my patience a few times on all man because they usually blitz you like half of the time on third down. And, you know, I still haven't improved in that situation. So, yeah, I kind of admit that was kind of my fault. Well, it actually, it is 100% my fault. So, yeah, I, play, I get the blame for it. And then right here, nice uh, catch by him. I mean, I don't understand how the heck... This guy doesn't just yellow zone the goddamn running back. I mean, where is he, he's gonna go? There's no one else to cover up there. So I don't understand sometimes when Terrell Suggs really doesn't cover that little crow that people usually do. Another fourth and two. No, rejected. The screen was not possible. One minute and 30 seconds to go. Back in the offense. I do a screen myself. Doug Martin taking it not only for 20 yards, 30 yards, and gets stopped after a 30 yard gain. A counter run to the right side to run down the clock. Marshall Lynch breaking tackles, running like a goddamn powerball. Run down the middle. Marshall Lynch yet again. First down, 49 seconds to go. Second and eight. Running more of the clock down because it's it's already like 46 to go. And that's game. 36 seconds to go. All I had to do is just kneel it. All his timeouts are done. Third and three. 36 seconds to go. It's, it's, it's over. Just kneel it and kick the field goal. That's it. That's all I have to do, because I'm afraid I'm a fumble. Okay, that's why I didn't call in a run a run play. 
So what happened next was that my opponent, the cowardly dog, ended up quitting. Unbelievable, fucking coward. Let me win the game. This is like the, come on man, I'm tired of this. Oh, you only earned 60 points, I mean 16 coins because, you know, your opponent quit. This should give us more than that shit, man. I'm tired of, of only earning 30 coins because my opponent quit the game. This should give us like at least 10,000, man. That's too exaggerated. I, I, like at least a full coinage, man. Just give me the fucking win coins. So anyways, I ended up winning, guys. Good job on my defense. It was a nice standout game right there. Um, you know, defense, you deserve the gold medal. It's been the first time in a while since you actually do something compared to Season 5. You know, it was quite terrible last season. So that's it, guys. You guys have been enjoying the series and you guys support the series. Make sure you leave a like because that will show you support. So that's it, guys. Make sure you subscribe for more. We're currently 3-0 in Season 5.2. If you guys want to see more, subscribe for more. And I'll see you guys later.